Hi, my name is Alex, and I'm a co-founder of VidSwap.com. I'd like to take you through a quick demonstration of everything VidSwap.com has to offer. So first, when you upload your game, we break it down in 12 to 24 hours or less, faster than anybody else out there. Think of us as a video assistant 24-7, 365. We save you hundreds of hours per season so you can better teach your players and get more out of your video. Secondly, VidSwap allows you to collaborate and share your analysis with your entire team from any browser or iOS device. But lastly, the iOS app is one of our most popular features. Your analysis can be in the palm of your hand on the bus, the plane, or the locker room, and you don't need an internet connection. So again, VidSwap does all of the work for you in 12 to 24 hours or less, faster than anybody else out there. Your breakdowns are online so you can collaborate with your entire team. And the iOS app gives you offline use for film sessions anywhere. Now let's take a quick look at how VidSwap.com works. Your dashboard has all of your available apps. So now your videos here, this is where you'll upload all of your games, practices, training videos, scout videos, all those videos that you want to edit and share with your team. You'll see a list of all your games and you have the ability to check multiple games and do a multi-game analysis. You can also email links outside of your team to anybody that you need to share with. On our editing, we use a timeline-based editor. This timeline allows us to tag all those different situations throughout your game, giving you granularity to be able to pull up any kind of situation that you need to, whether it's smaller individual set play possessions, transition possessions, or individual shots, rebounds, turnovers, any kind of those small, large, or cross-section possessions across the entire game, that's what this editing allows you to be able to do. The filter allows you to pull up any situation that you want to view. We do tag players on all of the games for you, so you can not only pull up situations based on players, but also get statistics on your players as well. Once you have a filter up, you can select plays and then build highlight presentations or reviews that you want to share with your players. The video player has all the playback controls for play, pause, slow motion, fast forward, get forward and backwards. And we do support HD video, so your video is going to look great. Stats show your box score, plus a number of analytical statistics and any kind of custom stats that you want to be able to add. Documents is where you can upload things like playbooks, scouting reports, practice plans to share with your team. If your whole conference uses VidSwap, then you'll have an additional schedules app. And this is where exchange is done. And we actually break down all the video throughout the entire league, giving you instant access to any situation across any number of games. Highlights is where you can manage video presentations for your team or your players. You can add and edit descriptions. You can also add telestrations that save on top of your video to further teach your players. Rosters is where you'll give login access to your entire team so they can watch a video from any PC or iOS device. You can also set custom permissions to control what your players can see. This is where you can also set any roster information for any opponents or scout games that you want us to tag for you. Reviews are assignments that you give to your players so you can teach them more effectively. They're very similar to highlights where you can add clips, add to illustrations and notes, but then you also have a chat thread on the right that you can have a conversation with your players. On every review, you have a report that shows you the engagement analytics, how much they've looked at it, when they looked at it, how much time they've spent, total comments, all those kinds of things that help you keep your players accountable. Your stats show your cumulative season statistics plus stats on each individual game and any custom calculations 
that you've added to your stats. Settings is where you can create custom tags that you'd like to add on top of your game, like for different set plays, defense, or anything else you want to add. The help sections is where you can learn how to use many of our great features and ask for help. The upload button is on the right, and the top right corner is your account information where you can manage your login and subscription information. Lastly, let's take a quick look at the iOS app. So our app works for both the iPad and the iPhone, and the best thing about our app is you can download video and edits into the app for offline use. So film sessions can be done from anywhere. You can plug your device into a projector or a TV, then do film sessions in front of your team. Once you're logged in, you can go into your list of videos and next to these you'll see there are cloud icons that basically tell you whether or not a game is downloaded or it's streamable. If I see a cloud that means I can click into it and view it via Wi-Fi. But if I tap on that cloud, now I can download that video and all the edits into the app for offline use. When I click into a game, I've got my player controls on the right and on the left. I can move those controls to the bottom and I've got my play pause, slow motion, all of that. Whenever the video is paused, I can use my finger and I can draw on screen. The top right corner is my filter that I can click in any situation that I want to look at. And then when I pull that filter up, it's going to show me all the information about each clip on the top. This is a scrolling play data here. And I can go through and then watch each clip. So in conclusion, that's a quick look at vidswap.com. We break down your games for you. If you'd like a more in-depth demonstration, please contact us.